What is up, YouTube? Sour Pack James back at it again. Today, got a fun one. I was going to check out some flagship 2023 All Elite Wrestling Hobby Box. But before we get to all that, first time check out the channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. It'd be greatly appreciated. All those who've been watching, thank you once again for your support. And so here we go. Just stop by from my local car shop. And today, we got ourselves a new release of 2023 All Elite Wrestling. I think this uh, bad boy just came out last week. Uh, got this for about $90. And um, yeah, pretty decent price. I think you can get last year's uh, box for about $60 or $70. So if you're not in a rush, you can always just wait on these and you know get them for pretty cheap. Um, seems like we're gonna get a ton of cards. Uh, anything of note here? Looks like we're guaranteed at least either an auto, mem, or a tech card. Uh, hopefully we get the auto. And then I know they have uh, this year's uh, version. They have like these uh, playing card, double nothing playing card edition. So it's very cool that we at least get one gold parallel version of that. And um, yeah, let's just check it out. Let's kind of see these cards in hand. We should get a lot of cards. Should get a ton of uh, inserts. So let's check it out. Hopefully get something really good here. And yeah. Let me know down in the comments if you're going to pick up some 2023 All Elite Wrestling Flagship. Um, from what I've seen so far and what people have talked about, this is probably their best version of the flagship product. So, um, yeah, I felt last year was an improvement over the uh, uh, initial debut release. So hopefully year number three, um, yeah, we'll see if it get any better here. So here we go. Tons of packs, tons of cards here. Let's just get at it. See what we get. So here we go. Look at the base card here. Check it out. Pretty cool there. So we got ourselves a hook. Eddie Kingston. Got Austin Gunn here. Looks like this is the bronze parallel maybe. And then the We Are Elite insert of Thunder Rosa. And here we go. This is should be the Firework Parallel. Always a big fan of those. Of tag Teams, Top Flight. Total Access inserts for Strickland. We got the All in the Family, Ray Phoenix and Penta. Another All in the Family of, of the Young Bucks. There you go. So pretty cool. Not sure if I like the base design compared to last year's, but I think when you, uh, for me, if you have a dynamite or parallel version, still looks really nice. Got Max Caster, Jamie Hayter, Jade Cargill, Bronze. We are Elite, Samoa Joe. And then we got a Dazzlers of Brit Breaker. Check out this looking insert. Very cool card. We'll take that. We got the We Are Elite Anna J. Malachi Black. And Jay Lethal. Hopefully everyone is having a good holiday. Just a few days uh, till Christmas here in the States. And then Adam Page, Rush, Chris Dantlander, Bronze. We are the Elite, Adam Cole. And here we go, all in a family. Not sure what which parallel this is. Uh, but very cool looking. It has that flash uh, kind of parallel from Panini. Ethan Page and Tony Siobhan. Next pack, we got ourselves Sammy Guevara, Will Nightingale, Renee, got a bronze. Of the Young Bucks. Uh, I guess we can put that there. We are elite. And then here's our first uh, Joker card or uh, double not even playing card, Eddie Kingston. Very cool. It does definitely feel like an actual playing card. So very nice touch there. And then we got uh, Preston and Rush. The tag teams. Put that over there. And then we got Taz. Actually, let me put the. So I can tell already uh, if you just buy one single box, you can get a lot of cards. So I wouldn't be surprised if it's going to be a lot of dupes as we get into the other piles. 
Wheeler Yuta, Holland the Family, Brock Anderson, and Arn, 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 Arn Anderson, blah. And then we've got a bronze Ruby Soho. We got the Excalibur picks of Willow. Let's put that over there. And then, oh, look at this. We got a Ethan Page World Tour. Kind of a hologram looking card there. Pretty cool. I like it. Got Tay Mello and Preston Vance. All right, that is almost done for the first pile there. Got Ricky Starks, Matt Jackson. Got the tag teams of the guns. Got Rick Knox, bronze. Into the ring, insert. Or stepping into the ring. And then our first UD canvas of Darby Allen. Guys, a fan of the UD canvas. Riho and John Moxley. All right into the second pack here. Got FTR, Bryce Rensburg, Claudio Casanoli, and then Max Caster. And then there we go. This is out of 199. Check this out of Alex uh, Excalibur picks a willow. Very, very cool. We'll take that. Excalibur, Hikaru Shida, and Dax. So I'll leave down a link to the uh, checklist so you can see who's on and who's not on it. See all the names for our different parallels. I got the Acclaim. We got Switchblade, Bronze, Matt Menard. Got We Are Elite, Jade Cargill. Got a Stare Down. Look at this. Very cool there. Uh, Serpentacle. Hello there. Uh, Tara Vakri, Takashi, and then on the family, Hook and Taz. Got Tony Storm, Ray Phoenix, Christian Cage, Pack Bronze, We Are Elite, Ruby Soho, got a UD Canvas, Samoa Joe. Uh, Alex Reynolds and Kenny Omega. I'm probably gonna blast through the base cards now. I think we got a good flavor of what they are here. So let's just see. You got a bronze here of Renee and Mockley. We are elite. Keith Lee. And then there we go. Got a fireworks of Sammy Guevara. Let me put that over here. Back, and then best friends. Almost halfway. Got ourselves Buddy Matthews. Got a Warlord Bronze here. And stepping into the ring, Claudio. Got a, here we go, another playing card of Powerhouse Hobbs. Swerve, Orange Cassidy, and Bowens. And officially, halfway into this hobby box what do you guys do you guys like having a lot of packs for your uh hobby box here personally i'm more of like I, I like something in the middle i don't like opening up too many packs where there's like a ton of cards we are elite brian danielson and then we got a dazzlers of tony Storm. so these are probably one of my favorite inserts so far sort of strickland and paul turner uh but that's just me But if you are um, set collecting and trying to get as many cards as possible, I feel like, yeah, this is like a uh, hobby box is pretty good value. I'm sure they're going to come out with the uh, retail blasters as well. So you can get cards that way. Um, and then... Or another way is just uh, wait on eBay for about a week or so and people just start selling their uh, sets. I also see those. Um, being sold on like Facebook groups. So there are specific AEW trading card Facebook groups and you just join. That's another way if you want to, if you're chasing singles. Got the all elite moments of Dr. Britt Baker. Pretty cool there. And then we got another Dazzlers of Ruby Soul. Tag team, Parker, Colton Gunn. Reiner, 
Jericho, Jackson, Bryce, Lee, got an Eddie Kingston, Firework, Julie Hart, and then Sammy and Tay there. We are the lead leech source. And then we got our looks like a red dynamite of John Moxley. We'll take that for sure. Is it numbered? Oh, here it go. It is out of 249. Not sure if you can see that, but it is out of 249. So very cool there. Definitely like the dynamites. On the family and stain. So that would be our second number card. Got one out of 199 for Willow and then a one out of two ninety nines of John Moxley, so not too shabby. Jericho pack total access there. Maybe a bronze, and then we got a Matt Menard playing card. Dan Housen, MJF, Athena. All right, Saint Knox, Knox Jackson, bronze here. We will lose. Yuta, we got a canvas, Dante Martin. Kenny Omega, we are the elite. Edwards and Annie, Anna J. All right, we're down to our last pile here. Here we go. Let me know if you guys will be getting any wrestling cars to rip for the holidays. Our Darby Allen bronze. And then we got a mic check, Sting, pretty cool. So we can put that over, maybe over here. And then we got Ayers are gold of Matt Hardy. So there you go, that is a gold. Very cool looking card. So um, yeah, if I was going after the playing cards and definitely try to snatch up some of the gold ones for sure. Really cool in person. Here. Bronze Tony Storm, got Pac, and got a Dazzlers of Julia Hart. Very cool, excited to see her title run. So I wanna say that Ethan Page is maybe our hit. I think that's considered a tech card, but we shall see. Uh, Ray Phoenix, Bronze, Athena, we are lead. UD Canvas of Satnam Singh, there we go. Tay and Ants. Got three more packs. Here, Mark Sterling, we are elite John Moxley. Willow Nightingale, firework. Although, it's weird. Hard to see up on top. Oh, there you can kind of see it. At least in person, it's hard to see. Put that over there. Put Baker. Garcia and Darius Martin. Two more packs. Got Hager, Bronze of the Acclaim, Total Access Powerhouse Hobbs. And then we got a Matt Jackson playing card. Very cool. Penta, Powerhouse, Beretta. And down to our last pack, see if we can finish strong here. Got a Switchblade, Bronze. Got a Julia Hart, we are the Elite. Got a Cash Wheeler, Red Dynamite, out of 249. I think I said uh, 299 last time. It's actually 249 for the Red Dynamites. Nyla Rose, and I'm gonna finish off with some Penta and uh, Phoenix. So there you go, that is one hobby box of 2023 AEW. Uh, let me package everything and I'm gonna recap after this. All right, guys, we are back with a recap of our hobby box. Uh, did okay, not the best box in the world. Definitely got a lot of cards. Here's some of the more notable ones. This flash looking insert is the AEW Dynamite Parallel. You can see here, as noted there, kind of looks like a flash parallel from any Panini cards. So pretty cool there, not numbered. Uh, we got the stare down of Serpentico. Cool looking clear acetate card there. 
And then the Dazzlers are probably my favorite inserts, just great looking cards there. And then we got a couple of number cards, the Red Dynamites out of 249 of John Moxley, Cash Wheeler. And then we got the purple out of 199 of Willow. Very, very cool there. Also got the gold of Matt Hardy from the playing cards. So definitely, uh, I like the concept of the playing cards. Very cool. And the gold ones look great in person. And then we finish it off with the World Tour uh, Ethan Page kind of like hologram cards. So this is would be, I guess, considered our hit of the uh, box. So no auto, no mem card, but we got this like hologram looking card there. So there we go. Not the best box in the world, but for $90, definitely get a lot of uh, cards in it. And if you're set collecting, you know, it's definitely a way to go there. So let me know what you guys think of 2023 flagship AEW wrestling cards down in the comments. Uh, as always, Sour Pack James you can check me out on all my different socials. And until next time, guys, just enjoy the rest of your week. And as always, happy holidays. All right, guys. Until next time, it's been real.